It is an honor to be here at my last, and perhaps the last, White House Correspondents' Day. <laughs> you all look great. The end of the Republic has never looked better. <laughs> Next year at this time, someone else will be standing here in this very spot. And it's anyone's guess who she will be. But <laughs> we've got the bright new face of the Democratic Party here tonight, Mr. Bernie Sanders. Bernie, you look like a million bucks. <laughs> or to put it in terms you'll understand, you look like 37,000 donations of $27 each. <laughs> Feel the burn. Feel the burn. It's a good slogan. Uh, Hillary's slogan has not had the same effect. Let's, let's see this. <laughs> Ted had a tough week. He went to Indiana. Hoosier country, stood on a basketball court and called the hoop a basketball ring. What else is in his lexicon? Baseball sticks, football hats. <laughs> but sure, I'm the foreign one. Is this dinner too tacky for the Donald? What could he possibly be doing instead? Is he at home eating a Trump steak? <laughs> Tweeting out insults to Angela Merkel? What's he doing? The Republican establishment is incredulous that he's their most likely nominee. Incredulous, shocking. They say Donald lacks the foreign policy experience to be president. But in fairness, he has spent years meeting with leaders from around the world. Miss Sweden, Miss Argentina, Miss Azerbaijan. <laughs>